Hello everyone, I think you all are okay. Welcome to our channel, Bethrikami Tech. Today, I will discuss about a simulation software, electrical simulation software, Ecatis. Now we will open this software. Now we will open a folder. Open. This is Here is the software already I drawn here as different parameters. You see this is the element as quantity level. Again if I press this then it will appear again. This is the here is from different element there are elements here if we enlarge this is different motors or supplies and systems. This is all the elements. Here already we used different elements. You see already I have drawn here some circuits. Here is a Swiss. At first we want to see a single little drawing. If we delete this also we delete. Delete. Here we will use a Swiss. Just push Swiss. If we double click this then it will appear from here to here from here we will take this switch here then again we will keep a lamp double click here and we will take this to light on this lamp we need power supply anyone neutral and phase suppose S okay this is S phase and also need neutral this is neutral now we will connect here you see a center circular we connect this this point this is to be up or down left right as you required again we connect from here to this light and here to neutral okay to check this simulation software at first we have place this run mode you see if we press then run mode then at this time if we press this switch here is the light is on if we press this light is on you can write here at first you have to stop this and select this is Swiss S W I C S only five characters you can write here Swiss supply supply this is lamp this is neutral okay to select this then you can this is from here to here you can this written word you can shift from one place to another okay if we change this this is OA if you need you can shift this writings now again if we want to check this here we press and it is the light is on again if we open this connection then it will open in this way we can check all this simulation circuit and the equipments that we have used here one two three you see here his S phase here is power supply lamp here is this lamp as lamp 2 that means here is one and also we have used here so total one and two this is lamp 2 this is quantity and this is label label means this one you see at first we need to stop this is selected this relay 
this is label r l y here also this is label you have to put this name if we change this you can change r1 okay this is r1 here is you see r1 here already we changed r l y one relay one and its contact is here you see now has different equipments used here this is start switch this is stop switch you can also specify this already we checked you can write here start one i written here this is stop put here the name and i connected this connection if you delete this you can connect here to this okay here you can select this way okay in this way you can put all the connection you can complete and here is single phase motor with automatic switch here is the motor you see a motor single phase motor and one is single phase motor with automatic switch this is automatic switch this is running coil and this is starting coil after some rotation this switch will open automatically if we don't use this automatic switch then a alarm will appear and the motor may problem you see for this circuit here is power supply stop switch start switch this is auxiliary contact for relay 3 when we switch on then power supply come to from here stop start it's relay to neutral and when this relay will energize when it's contact this contact will close and this is also this contact will close then this switch is bypassed by this contact and power supply will come this way to this through this contact to light now we will test okay at first run then if we press start you see this is this pink color here to here stop switch this close contact and this way also power supply this way at first power will go through this relay and then relay energize then this open contact will close and the light will on if we press stop then stop for this circuit here is used a timer this is you see here is the equipment named here as timer relay tmr1 this is open contact one we used close contact we have not used only the timer tmr1 here is the tmr1 only one open contact and for close contact we used no close contact is used zero 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 open contact relay one two open contact relay three two open contact and relay two one contact this is relay coil now we will check here we will run then we start okay start and timer is reducing time and after three seconds when it will zero then the motor started to run and this switch is open after three seconds okay you see again if we stop the motor will stop you see initially this switch is close and power supply passes through this way timer switch when timer is will energize after three seconds then this will close and relay to this relay to coil the timer will on then this coil to relay and this relay will energize when this relay energize then this contact will close and power supply passes through this way and through this way and after some time 
this switch will open and motor will run you see here the system here is the timer is reducing zero then this energizes this contact close the motor is running and this switch is open you can stop you can start you see this contact this contact instantly not opened after two or three seconds this is opened okay in this way we can simulate the circuit okay again we can see another circuit already we drawn some circuits you can see here is complementary without timer in the circuit we have not used any timer this is single phase motor you see here is no switch so if we press the power supply there may some alarm this is also same here is to relay relay you see r1 r2 relay start button single phase motor this is single phase motor and here is phase r phase r phase and neutral and here is open contact relay 1 2 relay 2 1 and this is close contact 0 now again we will check here is our start switch ok start switch you see after some time an alarm motor complement equal is not separated ok this complementary coil this is not separated that is current flow through this coil and through this coil so there is a problem ok to remove this we will see another option we can remove this by pressing this unit and also remove this by pressing this unit ok and we can save this by save as save as you need to this is a EKT files if you, if you change this in another format then it will not appear so you have to select this EKT files here you can see we will st uh, used this is a timer relay this is relay you see here is time relay time relay 2 here is T1 and here is T2 you can select timer you see at first we will shift this position and then if we here time time is 8 you can 5 press this or you can sense we have at first the time set at 8 8 second when we start this then current passes through this timer coil and this relay when this relay energizes then this contact is r1 it is close and the, this timer will start after 5 second this timer will energize and this is timer t1 t1 here is contact this contact will close and this relay r2 will energize and when r2 energizes then this relay energizes and parts of will available to this motor we will see run press start you see the time is reducing at 2 1 0 motor start and when this one this is a timer we used but here is a problem because the complement coil is not separated okay there is a problem already we use this circuit to see this by using this timer circuit again we will see another option okay
Now we will open another circuit here. Here you can see here is a timer contact. This is in previous like this, but here is a contact, close contact for timer T2. You see here is a close contact level T2, here is T2. When we press start, we have to press run, then this timer will time zero, then motor will start. And this timer here is contact zero, then this is opened, has no problem. You see the motor is running. Again we stop. Here is the timer difference is 8 minus 5, 3 seconds. If we large this time, increase this time, you see, suppose here we put 10 seconds, ok. Again we will start, here difference is 10 minus 5, 5 seconds and start. 5 seconds the motor will start say start but here is 4 3 2 1 so this coil is this uh, contact is open after 5 seconds within this time an error occurred so motor complementary coil is not separated okay again if we reduce the time suppose 7 second okay now we will again check start what is running and after second this is opened has no problem you see stop again start this time what is running and an open so if this time difference is more than three seconds then there is a problem in this way no problem like this we will see another circuit okay Here we used a switch. Practically, we will observe. Okay, everything is okay. In previous, we used here a timer contact, but here is a push switch, manual switch. Now, if we check this, when it starts switch, then current will flow through this way. This timer, timer energized, then this contact flows. Then timer energized after five seconds this contact will energize and this relay energize and th then for this relay this contact will close and this will start but here is if we open this switch then motor no problem but if it is close position then after uh, 4 to 5 second it will face a problem we will check start 5 4 3 2 one zero motor start if we press this open no problem you see the motor is running and no problem again close before three second it is not problem if it exists for more than three second then a problem appear you see here is a problem okay but if we open before 3 second, again you see start this time appear open ok. After starting if we open this then no problem. Again before 3 second if we open again no problem but again open no problem keep it more than three seconds then a problem create okay this is for single phase motor you see 
Here is two types of motor. Single phase motor and single phase motor with an automatic switch. Here is no automatic switch. So, this problem appeared. Again, we will use another circuit. Okay. Open. Triple contact. You see, here is a triple contact relay contact. Practically, we have different relays which have three contact for larger motors, larger capacity motor. We need triple contact or three phase motor. We need, but uh, by using three contact, triple contact, we use here only a single phase motor. This motor is single phase motor with automatic switch. This is automatic switch. Now, again, here we press test. If we start, this time value can be changed or large. You can see when you need to change, then this will be green. Here, for suppose six. Okay. Now, start, run, start. After six seconds, this coil is. This is started and automatically this is opened, so no problem. Here is three contact, this is another close and this is parallel. We can use a single contact, no problem. We will see later. Okay. You see, no problem. Again, you can check this depending on this time okay what is running we can reduce this time suppose two second okay now again we will check start two se after two second motor started and everything is okay you can use different element, suppose timer, relay, switch, lamp, start stop switch, as you like. Triple contact, yes, power supply for three phase power supply, three phase motor, start delta connection, three phase motor. Hmm. You see, here is three phase motor. Stop. If you double click, then it is appeared. We no need so we delete this equipment here. Okay. Again we will see another circuit, new circuit. This is you see here is also we used here a single contact. You see only we will check start this is time where we look five second. This is already started, yes. No problem. This contact is like this previous. Here it is shorted. After some time this is opened and this induction coil is opened and only for this contact what is running. Okay. Again we will check. After pressing the start switch, if you press two or three times, no problem. But if you <laughs> stop switch or single time it will completely open no need two or three times but if you first time start no need at the running time if you press the start switch no problem okay, okay. we see another circuit <coughs> here is we used A door contact, a door switch. Suppose the circuit is inside a door enclosed system. You see, if we open the door, then the motor will stop. The here is a close contact. When close, then power supply will from here. You see, this is red power supply. Coming from here to this way, then this switch to this way to here. So for this door, if, we, if, if it 
it is open then the power supply is hampered and it will the motor will stop okay now again in this way we will check start okay here is also timer used relay has also relay to the equipments door system start button time relay single phase motor the automatic switch stop button or phase relay and putter this is the equipment and this is the symbol one you will not understand you see this symbol and the name and this items are available here stop okay again we will see another one this is reverse switch we can start again you see if we start the motor started the here is the time is timer is used reverse timer you see here is the element reverse time relay okay this is reverse time relay this is you see here is reverse time relay 1 t1 reverse time relay when this motor will stop then after stopping it will this motor after a switch of this stop switch after 5 seconds the motor will stop you see motor is not stopped and this time comes to zero then stop again you see we can sense we can sense this value suppose 10 10 second okay start instantly start if we stop this then 10 second it will start after 10 second the motor will stop this is reverse time delay this is zero and stop okay this is this is another time delay system again we will see another one here you can see you see here the equipment here here is three phase see if forward reverse there is two triple contact used here when this will energize then the motor will run and at the same time if this two one energizes then a short circuit create and we will see this short circuit okay start here is only one circuit start and stop again this reverse again stop this will not stop this will stop here is a problem because if we suppose we start motor is running this way at the same time if we start this switch then two will you see two phases connected to each other so when two phases will connect each other then a larger short circuit will create so it is not a correct circuit okay so we have to need modify the circuit now we will see this again we see another circuit you see here is a circuit here we have not used main contact here is two contact just reverse and forward okay Here is this one. You see, here is no main contact. Here the motor no problem, but 
no main contact is used here. Check this. If we start, motor is running forward, and if we again we start, no problem. Okay, you see, because here is a open contact, uh, close contact we used, and this energizes. Then this is open again. Stop, and again this is start. Then reverse direction, and this is open. So if we press this, no problem, because this is open. So here is no problem for short circuit, but we have not used here main contact. There is only forward contact and reverse contact. This way. Okay. Now we will see another using main contact. With main contact, you see here. Here is the element. And you see, here is the main contact, and this is the circuit forward and reverse. This when this main contact will arise, then power supply come from this contact to forward and reverse contact. You see. Now we'll start. Here current passes through this contact, this contact to this main contact arises, and at the same time. This contact will energize. Current passes this way to forward direction. If we stop this, no problem. Or if we start this, no problem. Stop, then stop. Again, if we start another direction and we press start, no problem. No short circuit. This stop, no stop. And this is stop button. Here is start this way, and here is start this way. Just forward reverse. Okay, friends. Already we have seen different circuit diagrams. Also, we can draw start delta connection and another circuit uh, that you need. In this way, after connecting the live. Equipments. We can check the drawing, and by the simulation software, if any problem, then we can modify to reduce the accident. It is very helpful for electrical circuit simulation. I think it will be advantages from this software. In future, we will see another. circuit if you face any problem please comment i will try to give answer thank you to download the eket software we have to open a browser software suppose this is here we will write eket simulation software eket simulation software Okay, download. Here you see here is electrical control technique simulation. We click this, and here is download. Okay, as download here, we'll open this folder, and here is this is downloaded software. Here you see here is two setup option. Also here you get a setup, but this is Windows. Installer package. We have to set up this from application. If we press this yes, then it will be installing. We cancel this. Another version product is already installed. So in our PC, already this software is installed. So this message: if you install first time, then it will be installed. Okay. In this way, we can install the software in our PC.